You've heard of change. We all have. It's legendary power. The curses from people who don't want it. Foolishness about it being impossible to achieve. Due to various things, but mostly attributed to human nature. A bright, shining monument of what could have been set in the future and dreamt of by many. All of you know your own set of friends, their personal lives and their desires. Hey, maybe even your very friendship was based on your similar interests. So I think we can all agree that we have similar experiences to the daily life of the world. We have become numb from all the false promises given to us by the people we have elected, the people that we trust. Given the current state of the Philippines, we also have to agree on one thing. Our potential is being wasted and we must break free from the shackles set upon us. No longer should we wait in the sidelines, forced to watch as the cruel bureaucrats do as they please. We should stand up and raise our voice, for our country is a democracy, and part of being a democratic state is a glaring need for active participation. We have the power, we as the people. We are not meant to sit and wait as our representatives feed on our anguish, the poor becoming poorer and the rich becoming richer. You may think it's already too late, but the Philippines is a dome country, and no matter which way you look along it, it's hopeless. You may not be wrong either, but here's where our perspective shifts. It is only too late if you say it's too late. Music and music change is not only from outside, but also from within. Our current president and representatives can say and do what they do, but the real ones who have changed is us. We go about our daily lives, you, understand your friends, the their friends, their we acquaintances, the, the entire generation are the ones who need to internalize change. We all have grown mentality. This must be. If it's not, all, the of all hope made, for change. And on whose stability we fundamentally depend. Change is eternal. It always happens from every street time in society. From bottom to top. Nobody can fight this. It's only a part of the world. Until the very end. Where he hit that house. That's the only way. Change is if you're the one who looks in the mirror every day, looking for changes, then you already intrinsically want change. Change for yourself, for the better. Why not extend that to your comrades? Do what will not only benefit you, but others as well. Ever heard of the butterfly effect? I'll tackle the domino effect as well. I'll explain both. The butterfly effect is the concept that small causes can have large effects. One plastic bag that you throw away in the drain instead of throwing in the bin might end up being the last piece needed to completely block the drain and thus resulting in a flood that could have been averted. Don't be the cause of this misery, do your part. Now, the domino effect can simply also be called a chain reaction, for it is the cumulative effect produced when one event sets up a chain of similar events. People gravitate towards good things. Be the catalyst, change yourself, and I guarantee 
you can watch the others below you also change around you. The president can do lots of things, but he can't change every individual person, as a chain reaction from having lots of people do the same thing can. You want change? Change is coming, alright, but it has to start from you. Push yourself. Nobody else is going to do it for you.